Kate Cartwright is an incoming first year at the University of Georgia. Like many incoming college students, Cartwright is one of the many freshmen experiencing orientation in the midst of a pandemic. Cartwright chose to attend in person, hoping to connect with her future peers. Well, I was very happy to be able to see other people all together and especially a good portion of my freshman class. Recognizing the need for in-person options, schools like Georgia, Auburn University, and Columbus State University are offering dual orientation styles designed with COVID-19 in mind. Last year, CSU's orientations were completely virtual, but this year CSU held four in-person RAW sessions with the virtual orientation the day prior to each session. At the in-person orientations, incoming students toured the campus, met their orientation leaders, registered for classes, and received their student IDs. Bryce Hightower is one of CSU's orientation leaders for the summer 2021 session. He said the orientation experience is a little different this year, both in preparation and presentation. But the goal remains the same, both in the virtual and in-person setting building connections, and making sure students are confident in their decision to attend CSU. Whether a student chooses in-person or virtual, Hightower's advice remains the same. It's okay to be nervous. It's okay. Just come with your best foot forward. Because today, or any day you come, is about trying, seeing what you're comfortable with. Sarah Gray Bar, WRBL News 3, on your side.